Now, not everyone is elated at Shell's agreement to pay 45.9 billion naira to Ogoni community for the losses suffered as a result of oil spills. And then the Jin of Ogoni land and environmental activist Celestine Akpobori is one of those who think the oil major has not done enough. He was a guest on the breakfast on Plus TV Africa, as Mercy Ebopo reports. After 10 years, oil major Shell has agreed to uphold a court judgment to pay 45.9 billion naira for the losses suffered as a result of oil spills in Ogoni land. The news was well received by some Nigerians, but not Celestin Akobori, an environmentalist right activist and indigenous of Ogoni land. He says the money is insufficient to remedy the havoc caused by the company. No matter how much share pays, it cannot take away the pains from the heart of the Ogoni people. Because um, quite a lot have been lost. The entire livelihood of our people have been lost. Lives have been lost. Maybe you, you've not gone through UNEP report on Ogoni. That is a death sentence. And, and, and as far as I'm concerned, this is a patriotic sum. Energy expert Balaza Khan weighs in on the delay in upholding the 10-year-old judgment on the oil spill. Anything that has to do with, with court judgment, most of the time gets discussed or appealed to the highest levels. And when it gets to the higher level and highest level and there is a judgment, then it stands. So to that extent, I want to believe that uh, the reason why it took such a long time was because probably there have been appeals and counter appeals. But it got to a crescendo where it was very clear that Shell was going to be liable and they needed to respond to that. We seek to know from Zakar if Shell's recent agreement has anything to do with its planned divestment of its onshore asset in Nigeria. But we also know generally that when you, in, in the context of, of Nigeria, when you talk about land operations that we call onshore operations, some of the oil companies, both international and local companies, have been experiencing some, some degree of hostilities. And that has generally caused what we can call, what we can best describe as business climate hostilities. If the activist Akobori pushes through with his plans, the people of Agoni land may go back to court to try and get what they believe is a better judgment. Messi Bokbo for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.